Hey everyone, welcome to News and Notes. As usual, a whole lot of stuff happening in the life of our community uh, over the, this next week or so, but uh, we're excited. Moses and I are really glad to be with you today on this uh, rather chilly uh, Tuesday morning, but uh, excited about what's, uh, what's coming up in the life of our church. Uh, just before, we, before I hand over to Moses, I want to just say a big, big thank you uh, to all of those who were involved in the basketball tournament uh, this last weekend. What a load of fun. It was incredible. But a big thank you to all the volunteers that helped out, um, just the, the, from refs to the admin, the paperwork, the scoring. Uh, you have no idea. <clears throat> I learned very quickly uh, how much work it, <laughs> it, uh, it takes in that to get a tournament like that off the ground. But uh, we're really grateful. Um, and for us, it was a privilege to host it. Uh, this year and uh, keep a lookout for for what's happening next year i also want to just say thank you so much to the schools that were also involved um, that that helped out in that and were able to host some of the games uh, but mostly to the competitors well done on the winning teams uh, congratulations to you there was good sportsmanship there was good rivalry good competition and uh, it was really good so again thank you so much and of course as i said last week sunday a huge shout out to mary abbott who did a lot of the planning. Um, so thank you, Mary, for what you did. And uh, just, I, I think it was a, it was a huge uh, success. I think, as I said on, uh, on Sunday as well, I've just started learning the rules of, uh, uh, of football. Now I'm learning the rules of basketball. Oh, yeah. Go dogs. And um, yeah, it was, a, but it, was a great, it was a great time. Over to you, Moses. Yeah, lots of great things happening here. Uh, revolution is right around the corner. We will have a lock-in Friday, January 28th here at LSUMC, and then we will load up and head to Columbia for a full day of fellowship and worship. Do you, know what, do you know what the lock-in is? Yeah, yeah, you sleep over, you know, no. slumber party. Yeah, I just thing. needed to be understood what a lock-in was. I yeah. just, like, my mind was like, <laughs> where, where were we going to be locked in? But it's basically spending the night. Yeah. The night. Okay, it's cool. Spending the that, night. That's going to be fun. Yeah, so Revolution is the biggest youth event in the state. There will be great speakers and great music. If you have any questions about that, please reach out to Mary Abbott. Again, Mary is involved in a lot of things here. And uh, confirmation will begin with a mandatory parent meeting on February 20th during Sunday school hour. So if you are in 8th grade or if you know someone in 8th grade or if you have an 8th grader, please save the date. Please save the date. Confirmation is a time where our 8th graders will be able to better understand their faith and who they are as followers of Christ. If you have any questions about confirmation, please contact the church or Mary Abbott. Gary? Yeah, we're looking forward to confirmation 2022. Uh, and then just to say to you that obviously on Monday, you'll know that it's a, it's a, I think it's a public holiday everywhere. I'm not sure. Our offices will be closed. Uh, as remember, uh, Martin Luther King Jr. Day. Uh, and then just to say to you that there will be a unity march uh, taking place downtown Camden uh, starting at 11.30 at the Cultural Center, uh, marching to, uh, to City Hall or Town Hall. And, uh, and then at, at midday itself, there will be a whole a lot of events um, happening uh, downtown Camden. So won't you join us on Saturday, 11.30 at the Cultural Center if you're going to be part of the march, the unity march or at midday at uh, City Hall, and uh, to just be part of the incredible program that's going to be happening. Uh, for those of you, just a reminder that tonight at 6 p.m. is an introductory dinner to Alpha, the Alpha course that we're starting off uh, pretty soon, and uh, we are beyond uh, expectant of what the God is going to do during the Alpha, Alpha course. So come along tonight. It's no obligation. You know, if you get here tonight, you're not going to be signed up and uh, it means that you have to just tonight is about hearing more or wanting to know more about what the Alpha course looks like, how it runs, what it's going to uh, entail. So uh, come along tonight. As I said, it's an introductory dinner. So it'll give you a bit more information about how Alpha works, what's expected of you, what you can expect from Alpha. And that's tonight from six o'clock to seven o'clock tonight, only an hour. Come and check it out tonight. We're excited about that. Uh, and then, of course, uh, our pastor's Bible study uh, every Wednesday at 10 a.m. Um, in one of the Sunday school classes. I always forget which one it is. I just know how to get there. Uh, and we, we're picking up from John, uh, from John chapter 14 uh, this week on Wednesday. So come and be part of it on Wednesday mornings, uh, Wednesday morning at 10 a.m., 10 till 11. And then as we, we're busy with an exciting series entitled Love Never Ends, 
And uh, this week uh, we're working through Corinthians about the body of Christ. And we look forward to seeing you either at the 9 a.m. service or the 11.15 service this week on Sunday. Don't forget that you can get hold of all of this information off our website or also off our Facebook page. Uh, make sure that you follow us either on Facebook or Instagram. Uh, also, obviously, our services are, are on YouTube as well. But uh, we have a whole lot of information available uh, through our social media platforms. Moses, I think that's a wrap. I think so. Good job. Looking forward to seeing you tonight, sometime during the week. Come to Alpha tonight. You won't regret it. Uh, see you either tonight during the week or see you on Sunday. God bless you.